Hi, I'm Mansour Breck, the CTO for X2O Media, a Barco Venture. And today what I'll be showing you is how quickly we can build a dynamic dashboard using X2O's channel designer. So, what you're looking at is our channel designer tool. Down the left side we have our smart objects and we'll get started right there. I'm going to select the background, which drops right in. Then we will uh, take our logo cube, we'll place it up here. We'll make that a little larger. Okay. So all these smart objects are capable of fetching data, interacting with a user, etc. Everything that's required to, to achieve our goals. Um, now we'll throw in a news ticker. So we'll go to our news category. I've got a news ticker right here. Double click on that and it appears here and you can see it loading its data. So it's going out fetching live data from an RSS feed. Now we'll turn our attention to some of our dashboard objects which are a series of pie, pie charts, line charts, bar charts, etc. I'm going to use our world clock object and I'll just drag that on here. Okay, there we go. Now I'm also going to include a, a map ticker which will basically tick through the various countries that I'm interested in based on my data set. And let me, for good measure, let me add a gauge in there. And put that right over here. There we go. So now we want to add some live data to that. So we'll we'll go to our data access objects, and let's we have all sorts of objects allowing you to access SQL, SharePoint, RSS, Twitter, etc. I'm going to use our Excel spreadsheet object. Place that right there. Okay. Uh, double click on that object and we'll go right into our repository and we'll see what uh, we'll see what spreadsheets are available here's one that we've prepared for the show we'll select that i get a little preview of the data right here and now i'm going to drag and drop it onto those charts so we'll take the country column and i'll make that the label for this map and then we'll take this rank and we'll make that the data and then I'll do the same thing with this gauge. Country and the rank to data. Okay. And now there you have it. As the map ticks from country to country, the gauge will follow with the name of the country and the actual value, and they will be ticking in unison. Okay, so as a la another example, I'm gonna back to the dashboard object. And we'll take a pie chart. Here we are. Pie chart. We'll just size that here appropriately. And this time I'll take the country again, but uh, we'll do GDP. And there you have it. The pie chart is populated with that data. And we're almost done. There's a little space here, so for good measure, we'll throw in a little entertainment. I have a nice quote of the day object here. We'll Place that right there. Get out of the way. Okay. There we are. Abraham Lincoln was clearly a visionary. <laughs> so there you have it. I've built the channel now. I'm going to save it. And we'll, we'll take that to air and see how that looks. So save the channel. We'll call it my channel for Rave. A little plug for our interviewer. And now I get a link to the channel. So I'm going to click on that and I'll, I'll, it'll open up here for me. I'm just going to go full screen and the channel should come up in a moment. So there you have it. A professional dashboard built in front of you in, in minutes. For more information, you can find us at www.x2omedia.com. Thank you.